I am convinced that East Wash and Fair Oaks is the most dangerous intersection in the city. I almost died because someone was speeding. Probably was a drunk driver. <laughs> In the city of Madison, traffic accidents are a huge problem. According to a 2009 report, more pedestrians are killed on East Washington Avenue than any other street in the city. My cousin was crossing East Wash and out of the blue, this red truck came and ran him down. Janet Fawn blames the city of Madison for her cousin's death. The city has never done enough to enforce the traffic laws on East Wash. You can stand on the corner of East Wash and not see a police car for 20 minutes. Just last week, Mike Buck was nearly killed while driving through the East Wash and Fair Oaks Avenue intersection. I got rear-ended and ended up in the hospital with a concussion. It was a hit and run accident and the driver has not been caught by the authorities. I, I don't remember a thing, except waking up in the hospital the next day. Janet Fawn is suing the city of Madison for her cousin's death. Madison city officials refuse to talk on camera because of her lawsuit. They want to settle out of court because the city doesn't want the bad publicity of a trial. But they're going to get a trial, and the public is going to know that the city is not doing all it can to prevent more deaths on East Wash. Janet Fawn says the city has not contacted her lawyer. But if the city does offer a settlement, she says she is going to stick to her convictions and turn it down. Mike Buck grew up one block away from East Washington and Fair Oaks Avenue. He says that over the years, traffic has increased on East Washington. And I'm convinced that there's more people speeding and running lights, especially at night. That's when I got hit, at night. A big problem, according to Mike Buck, is the city has not kept up with the increased traffic. They have not added more police cars to patrol the street. If the city had more police cars on East Wash, I probably wouldn't have gotten rammed. I don't even have health insurance. I have to pay my medical bills on my own. In the 2009 traffic report listing East Washington and Fair Oaks Avenue as the most dangerous intersection in the city, there is a recommendation to lower the speed limit from 40 to 30 miles per hour. They won't. The city, they, they rather save a dime than pay for new speed signs. And people wouldn't slow down anyway. Why should they when there are no cops on the streets to stop them? City officials won't say if they will lower the speed limit on East Washington Avenue. Bring it, bust it, bust it, get your lead. 